It's raining out. I just got home from work. <laughs> Been long, long day. But I got home to this on my doorstep, which I know says Indigo, which is still a great store. But it's actually a gift sent to me from my old buddy, Linda, who sends me all those wonderful gifts that we see. She is a very generous person. So let's open it up and see what's in here. Cute little card, which I will read. Ugh, smells good. I'm gonna read it at the end, but it looks so cute. When life gives you lemons, and then a lot, a lot of writing. Let's see. Cut it up and squeeze it for a good, strong drink. No, it isn't Christmassy, but it's cute, and I have so many cute cards like this. Oh, well, anyways, what a year it has been. Thank God it is over. At least we haven't had another lockdown this year. <laughs> anyways, I wish you and your fam the best in the new year and that you had one awesome holiday. I miss you lots, even though I message you like every day. <laughs> it's just not the same. Oh well, maybe next year we uh, we can forever be online friends and male friends. <laughs> I promise to never glitter bomb you anyways. I hope you enjoy your present and all the randomness. Just things that I thought you would like, but that are so random. And books. I can never forget the books. Anyways, I'll try to not ramble on too much, but when I'm alone in my head, <laughs> all hell breaks loose. Oh, well, I just realized that I didn't get you a Sims present. That is sad. <laughs> I'm joking. You got me that. <laughs> um, I said that as I sit here watching James Turner next year. But then Sims 5 may be out. That is true. More fun. Anyways, I miss you and your face. I hope in the new year only good things come your way. Also that you get a Pegasus cheaper air. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Anyways, love you lots. Happy holidays and all the best. Love, Linda. Linda is the best. Thank you for the lemons. <laughs> oh, and I see one thing she sends me every year that I love. Reading socks. I prefer these to slippers. They're so warm and cozy and thick. And these ones are super cute. Thank you. Oh, my darling. Now this was something sticking out the top. More tea to try. The end crush. Fruity, tropical, and refreshing. This sounds amazing. This actually looks like one that JR would really like, too. And as always, Linda, your hair is on it. <laughs> Thank you. Ah, oh, these are so cute. Stickers. I love putting stickers on things that I mail. And good Lord, she had a lot of stickers to give. But how cute are they? The snow day. Oops. Hello, baby. <laughs> oh, two hello babies. Many babies, apparently. Some of those drinks. Ooh, these are sparkly. You can see that? Oh yeah, look at them go. Treasure chests. <laughs> these are just like fruit strips. <laughs> these all smell so good. They must have something smelly in here. Some butterflies and cup and cakes. I do love me some sweet, sweet cup and cakes. Oh, little farm friends. How adorable. These are all pretty cute. Little to-do lists or checklists with the farm friends. <laughs> oh, the tractors to go with the farm friends. Of course, the lemons. <laughs> More lemons. Fun fact, my dad would call us lemon heads when we were kids if he was mad at us. <laughs> oh, look at that. I love Mario. Of course, the Game Boy to play Mario with. <laughs> oh, loading. 
love that. Oh, goodness. Little cakes. I'm actually really hungry right now from being done work, so this is like torture. So many stickers. How do you collect so many dang stickers? Oh, a T-Rex tea infuser. Right now I have a, a manatee tea infuser, so this kind of goes with it. Love it. T-Rex is awesome. I also have little arms. Oh, there's some stickers that got away. <laughs> tea. Cute. Good lord. Stretchy unicorn. This looks like a lot of fun. <laughs> I must play with it now. Come here, unicorn. Oh my gosh. It's like a stress ball. Now it's a weird looking unicorn. <laughs> I love this. This is actually like some of the stuff I have at my workstation, like uh, the prizes from Kinder Surprise Eggs. So I think that's where this will go and it will blend in perfectly. Oh, it feels so cool. Although the cuppy thing it came in looks kind of funny. <laughs> there we go. There's a lot of tea in here, guys. Just peachy. Oh, I love peach tea. I love peaches in general. Some uh, Lucy Goosey ones too. Holy. Oh, I see the, the mentioned books. Wowie. Hot chocolate. You've made Jaro's day. This is his favorite. <laughs> this will actually fill up my tea box you gave me last year. Sleigh ride. Hazelnut chocolate sounds amazing. Sugar pear fairy. More salted caramel oolong. Winter Earl Grey. Earl Grey is my favorite tea. Palma Grateful. <laughs> That's a great name. Candy Cane Crush. I've had this one. It's really good. Peppermint Armor. Interesting. I love a good mint tea. Orange Spice. Delicious. Cinnamon Rubios Chai. These all look amazing. I want all of them right now. What's this? Handmade and ethically sourced from bubble to bowl. Oh, it's from Lush. That's what smells in here. So good. So what is it? Oh, <laughs> it's a little mommy. How cute. I love bath bombs. And this smells so good. That I'll have to hide from JR. <laughs> lip balms. I always need lip balms at work. They work outside. Peach flavored. Let's see. Mmm. Oh, yes. Delicious. You know, I don't ever really do a Christmas haul on all my gifts. I just show the things that you send me. Which I guess is about the same. Oh, well, it's so funny. You know Earl Grey is my favorite girl. <laughs> Winter Earl Grey. I'm excited for that. This thing's been sticking out. What's this? Vesper Raft Cocktails. Instructions. Fill the jar. Refrigerate one to three days. Shake and serve. Scan for the perfect red velvet sangria recipe. Oh my gosh. It's a jar of sangria. You just got to add the booze. I love that. I actually want to drink this with my mom. My mom, I know, loves sangria too. But you know my mom. And you love her too. So that may have been planned. Ooh, more socks. These are really cute too. And that's actually good because um, I only have one pair of uh, these left from before. So now I have a bunch and I'm set for the winter. Despite it raining today, it is still winter and I am still in Canada. 
And that is now on the floor. Okay, I think the rest of this is books, which maybe I'll give book reviews on. Lore Olympus. This, this book looks super cool. Scandalous gossip, wild parties, and forbidden love. Ooh, sounds like basically a drama about the gods of Olympus. That sounds exciting. I really can't wait to read that. But you know my tastes. They're your tastes. <laughs> Memphis Mayfire. Ooh. Did not know you got me the CD. That is awesome. Oh, I can't wait to listen to this. Ooh, it's exciting. Actually going to my parents soon, so that'll be nice for the drive because it's about two and a half hours. Come here, Bicky Bicky. Ooh. I've seen these before. It's like a blind date with a book. So it's young adult fantasy, book number one of a series. A teenage boy discovers he has supernatural powers. Any guesses? Any guesses? Anyone? Bueller? Uh, it's actually very hard to open. <laughs> they don't want anyone to peek, which I appreciate. Ugh. And it is one I haven't read before, so that is good. The Fallen. The Fallen and Leviathan. On his 18th birthday, Aaron begins to hear strange voices and is convinced he's going insane. But having moved from foster home to foster home, Aaron doesn't know whom he can trust. He wants to confide in the cute girl from class, but fears she'll confirm he's crazy. Then a mysterious man begins following Aaron. He knows about Aaron's troubled past and his new powers. And he has a message for Aaron. As the son of mortal and angel, Aaron has been chosen to redeem the falling. Fall in. Wow, this sounds really good. I love blind date books. I just love books, but blind date books, beauty. What we got in here? I see a game. Smash Up Expansion. Oh, cool. She actually got me this. Was it for Christmas last year or my birthday? So it's the expansion pack for a game I already have, which is cool. Maybe play that sometime this weekend. Since it's a long weekend for me. Letterboard. Oh, neat. So you put the letters on your letterboard. Make some cool signs. That's exciting. I like that. Oops. Running out of table space. Oh wow, there's actually a lot more lip balms. They're just really tiny, so they move around a lot. Oh. Pear Cobbler, Sweetie Pie, and Hot Chocolate with Marshmallows. This is great. I'm not gonna put them all on because I'm wearing peach now. It'll smell weird, taste weird. Oh wow, that smells so good pear cobbler which actually kind of smells like a cobbler like it's pear but then kind of like a sugary scent too sweetie pie mmm smells really good hot chocolate and marshmallows Ooh, this makes me want to have the hot chocolate tea now <laughs> awesome well that was a huge box filled with a lot of stuff Thank you so much, Linda. I'll send yours now that I have a giant box, although I don't know if I have that much stuff to put in as much as you. Wow. As always, you're super generous, and I love you. Thank you. I look forward to reading those books and telling you all about them.